Hello everyone, this is Omar. Welcome to the channel. This is the continuation of our RSCSA practice exam series. Uh, we are at question number 20 and it's about LVM resize. Uh, this, this would most probably be our last uh, video in this series uh, for now. If there are any updates, if I add any more videos, I'll let you know. But for now, it seems this we will complete our entire series with this video. So let's go ahead and read the question here. So it's asking us to resize the logical volume data LV1, which we created in our previous video. So we will be increasing the file system to 300 MB. So right now we created 1.6 GB, which is 1600 MB. So we have to add almost nearly the same amount, which we created. We have to double this, this one, the size. So check if the volume group have available space. Otherwise add new physical volume to volume group disk. Okay. And without make without unmounting or without making any changes to the data, the content should remain intact. So we should do it without affecting the content of the slash data one directory. So the first thing is let's go ahead and check the logical volume status. As you can see, we have three. This is the one which we created. Let's clear the screen and run it again. Okay. So this is our logical volume that, that need to be extended. So data LV1, they are asking us to update to 3000 M, which is 3 GB. Right now it is 1.56, almost 1.6 GB. So this is the volume group and this is the, so let's check if there is, it is asking check if volume group has available space. So this is the volume group and free space is 432 MB. So this is not fulfilling our requirement. We need one GB more. So we need to add the disk physical volume to this volume group. So let's see if we have any physical volume available. Yes, we do. This is the one. This can be our candidate disk. So we can add this disk to our volume group. So let's go ahead and create the partition dev as dt. Use GPT and we will say new default 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 that e zero zero right done so don't want rules let's be okay the partition is created all right so what we will do this one is done. We will create physical volume using PV create SDT1. And then we will extend the volume group. Because this volume group, we checked, it does not have the enough space to extend it. So we will first extend the volume group and add the new physical volume to this one. And now we will check if the available space increased or it did so it was only 432 mb free now we have 2.1 gb free so we can add we can increase the uh, logical volume which is part of our volume group all right so how do you do that we will use this command we can do it in multiple way but we are using this command let me clear the screen and paste this one. So LV extend, we are extending the logical volume. We are using capital L, which allows us to put the size to it. And then we are using minus R to resize the logical one. All right, so this will immediately take effects on our, but before that, let me show you. Look at it, our, our date, this mount point is 1.6 GB. All right, so we are going to extend the logical volume. 
using this command and you will add 1500 MB because it's already uh, 1.6 GB. So we have to make this one 3 GB, 3000 MB, which is 3 GB. So we need to add 1400 or 1500. We are adding 1500. Let's see what happens. And it does desizing required. Successfully desized. Okay, so let's check. Yes. We'll clear the screen. So as you can see, this is now 3 GB. So we successfully extended the volume. That's it for this video and this entire series. Thank you for watching. I hope you like it and I hope this will help you in preparing your RSCSA exam. And if there are if there are more topics that need to be added, please let me know. I will try to add them. And if you like it, do, do let me know. And I will be creating uh, the similar series for RHCE exam as well if the time permits so most probably next month or in the coming months I will try to create the similar series for RHCE exam and the other exams that I am preparing for so I may be creating such similar series for that as well so if you want me to create any specific video on a specific topic do let me know I will look into that for sure so thank you for watching. Have a good day.